I'm Lauren of All Trades, and today I'm cruising back to back on the Carnival of Paradise. Husband and I are doing back to back cruises on this cruise, so we're about we are halfway through our full back to back. So we've been on the cruise for five days now, and then we're going to stay on board tomorrow, mostly, and then have another five day cruise. So we got this letter in our mailbox and it explains how this process works. We got the regular debarkation information and we're going to ignore that. Um, so there's a whole letter explaining exactly what our options are, which we have two options. And one of our options is we're going to take, we could take these tickets and we can disembark with everybody else and then spend majority of the day in Tampa and hang out. Um, or, um, oh, and then we would present them again to get back on board. We get to go through the VIP line to get back on board and it says anytime after 1130. So if we wanted to spend less time on, off um, and get back on earlier, we wouldn't be able to do that. Um, the other option is to meet someone from Carnival in the piano bar, at least on this ship. It probably varies ship to ship. On this one, it's the piano bar. And they're going to walk us to um, immigration, prove that we're still on board and that we didn't, uh, we didn't jump ship in Cozumel. And then they'll walk us right back on board. So we're going to go with that option because um, we want to be back on board earlier than 1130 and really enjoy the ship being empty. Um, and then we might also tr see if we can use our passes to run off real quick and maybe buy some more soda or just to see how that works. Um, so that's what we're going to do tomorrow. So we don't have to pack any of our stuff because we're in the same cabin. If we were changing cabins, we would pack up all of our stuff, leave it during that getting off, coming back on period. Uh, we'd get a new, we're going to get a new sign and sale card either way. And then, but our steward would take it to our other cabin if we were changing cabins. But we're staying here so we get to leave everything out um, and just enjoy tonight. And we don't have to get out of bed until about 9.30. Um, so we're gonna see how that goes tomorrow. It is deparkation day, which for us is also embarkation day. We are headed to the piano bar to meet up with other back-to-back -back guests, if there are any. There's probably a few, and someone from Carnival to take us off and back on the ship. Best part about this is getting to use my cell phone halfway through the cruise. <laughs> no diamond guests and back to back meeting point. So it looks like there's four of us. And they gave us our new signing sale, sale and sign cards and like an updated photo for when we buy drinks at the bar. And we're going to come down here to the couches, take a group photo, and then do the immigration hoopla. Yep. In your look. So we're now being escorted off the ship. We're gonna go chat with immigration and come right back on. We did confirm that we can use our little in-transit cards if we later decide to um, go into Tampa and get some more soda or uh, whatever it is we might want to do in Tampa. Uh, we've got a few hours that we, until it's we have to be back on board, so we're not sure what we want to do yet. Yes, We got another thing. So I don't know if there's any more stuff that's gonna come. We'll have to see over the next 
five days. I feel like this is probably the last, um, but I'm pretty sure that I can't imagine what else this would be for except for our back-to-back -back, um, compliments of the hotel director. And we do have the option of calling them up and saying we like different fruits, but I'm actually pretty okay with this selection, so we're not going to do that. Um, we're just going to enjoy it. There was a little bit of confusion getting off the ship because we didn't do it the regular way, but we managed it. We just had them scan our cards, um, our sale and sign cards, so that they know we're not on board. And then we'll have them scan again when we come back on board. And we have our little transfer tickets so that we can skip the line um, coming back on, which there probably won't even be one because they've been boarding already for hours. Um, then we're going to try to find a drugstore to get some Dayquil because husband is feeling a little bit under the weather. And then if it's convenient, also get another 12 pack of Diet Coke for me and then we'll go right back on board. Okay, we're going to walk over to the trolley. Um, there's a public free trolley right by the cruise port. Uh, so we just walked out and turned the corner, kind of followed the trolley tracks, and there is where we can get on. That's where we'll probably also get off when we come back. It's already coming. That was excellent timing. And there's free Wi-Fi on board. So we found a Publix, and we have to cross the road. We found the Publix. It is less than a five minute walk from the trolley stop. at the tram stop and we'll just wait for the next tram. Thank you. Uh -huh. Here we are back at cruise terminal three where the carnival paradise lives. We're gonna drop off our soda in our cabin and we're gonna keep on cruising. That's it for me on the Carnival Paradise on my back-to-back -back cruise experience.